The high school students who created the Facebook page named it Benzie Fights and classified the group as an amateur sports team. Uh, several of the kids in talking with them referred to MMA fighting and either wanting to do that in the future or were practicing that or that's what they were doing uh, in the hallway in very short bursts of time. But Principal Larry Hahn says that's not an excuse. The students involved were disciplined and their parents were notified. Hahn says the students recorded their so-called matches in the hallway at the school and during school hours. These students were organized and every school has blind spots. If they're in the right place at the right time and keeping a uh, lookout to see if anyone is coming for that short 10 second or so time period, um, you know, it's, it's possible to do that. Staff are now looking into ways to prevent anything like this from happening in the future. They're also educating the students about what it means to post things on the Internet. Hopefully lesson learned about social media. Always better to be positive with what you put out as opposed to those things that could be something negative. Sheriff Ted Schendel says his department also looked into the situation. We, we checked with our county prosecutor. She didn't see anything uh, technically illegal simply from the standpoint that this is consensual and they're doing it for their own pleasure to put it on, post on Facebook. The sheriff says it does serve as a good reminder for parents to talk to their children about the potential dangers of something like this. Talk about the pros and the cons of social media. Social media has got a lot of good aspects to it. It also has some very, very negative connotations.